So we are on our way to my mother-in-law's house. We are finished with church. Shane's gonna go hunting for the afternoon and we're gonna go to the gala. <music> Friends, I am here at my mother-in-law's house. We were hanging out um, after church. Uh, she went hunting, and we grabbed all of our stuff that we would need for the gala tonight, and just came over to my mother-in-law's, which is what we usually do on Sundays. It's um, just always so nice to just hang out here. We kind of sometimes do things together, and then sometimes we just like exist in the same space, and it's just wonderful. It's like you do life together. Um, so I'm just editing a video. We had some lunch. We had some hot chocolate. The kids are playing. Aubrey's helping Grandma decorate. Colt's helping Auntie Sarah do some stuff around the house. Um, and we're just relaxing. Tonight is the gala, and it is going to be so nice. It always just kind of kicks off Christmas, I feel like, because um, it's always the last November before uh, December. <laughs> the last November. The last Sunday evening. Uh, in November yes so anyways we're really excited about that um, we've been looking forward to it the whole family's going except my sister-in-law Anne and my father-in-law he had to go out of work um, out of town to work does anyone else have the hardest time getting out of the house with their kids when you are like needing to be somewhere and dressed appropriately because oh boy Aubrey had gotten into the clothes and left her shoes at home so now she has to go barefoot. But we are on our way. Shane and I are riding together. Grandma is taking the kids. So off we go. We won the race. We no, won. I won the race. No. We did a race and you and dad had to go in together to win. Yeah, that we made a new rule. Oh, beautiful. 
such a good time at the gala it oh, we've gone I think this is now the third year that they've had it and we just have the best time it kind of kicks off Christmas for us um it was just I don't know really lovely it, I loved at the very end just seeing my kiddos and Shane helping to clean everything up um I had on my heels and I was holding a ton of stuff, so I sort of, I helped in between. Um, but I, I don't know, it just did my mama heart so good. Um, I didn't get to really chat much with you all today. Uh, so I thought I'd just take a couple minutes to say hello and kind of chitty chat with you. So I'm actually filming on my new phone. Um, I Shane and I were due for an upgrade. We were kind of just on contract um, and kind of, you know, paying month by month at this point because we were ready for new phones. And Costco was having a Black Friday sale. Um, and so we got uh, the new um, iPhone X. Sorry, my mind is just like crazy. So we got the new iPhone X, which is like really fun. Um, I'm still learning how to kind of get used to it because it's a bit of a different phone than the regular iPhones. I went from an iPhone 6s. So it has some different features and just a different way of navigating things. So uh, I'm trying to learn to get used to it, but I also don't have a case on it. I have a um, like something on the screen so that it doesn't like shatter if it's dropped. But I don't actually have a case. So, oh, see, I'm like learning to get used to this. And my arm is getting tired. Um, and I'm just really afraid I'm going to drop it. So I've ordered can um, a case from Amazon, but it won't be here for a couple more days. So I'm like gingerly and very tightly holding this phone so I don't drop it. And I was really afraid that I was going to drop it at various points. So I'm trying to be really careful with it. Um... 
what else so this was our first day back at church um, we had tried to go a couple of other times but just things happened and we weren't able to get there so this is our first time at church uh, since Hart had passed away walking in this morning um, I just got a little overwhelmed with emotions um, not to the point of crying but I definitely did have tears uh, and then during worship, it was just so powerful in the presence of God. You could just feel it. Um, and I did. I cried quite a bit. So I cried a lot of my mascara and stuff away. Uh, so I looked a little funny when I was vlogging earlier. But um, yeah, and just in talking with a few different people, I cried a bit. And, you know, um, we are largely doing really, really well. But um as we just walk into different spaces and places and things have new meaning to us, um, you know, emotions arise. And thankfully we are just surrounded by people who care and just kind of love us through. Just a little channel kind of update. I am hoping to do, I'm not committed to doing Vlogmas Vlogmas um, where you vlog every day. I just, I, every time I attempt to do it, I can never get through it. But I am planning to vlog a lot. We've got a lot, of course, like everybody <laughs> that will be going on. Um, and I realized that my vlogs have really meant a lot to me, uh, especially in light of heart passing. Like, all the things that I captured prior to that just mean a lot to me. Um, pictures and Insta stories and just everything that I had saved from that time period just really means a lot so um I, I i do plan to vlog and want to capture moments with my kids and with shane and just um celebrating life and celebrating um jesus and celebrating family and christmas and all the good things so um i do hope to bring you along just as much as possible but don't expect a vlog every day expect a lot of vlogs just don't expect them every day. <laughs> okay. Anyways, I've rambled enough. Um, I hope you guys are doing really well. Your comments mean everything to me. So thank you so much for always leaving me such encouragement. You guys are my friends and I appreciate you to the moon and back. And I'm sorry if I'm not looking at the right spot on the camera. I still, like I said, it's all new. <laughs> um, and I can't quite see a camera anymore. So I'm just kind of guessing. Anyways, have a good night guys. Bye.